Hi, it's me again with Corel Draw Tips and Tricks, and today's video is going to be about setting up some guidelines. And there's probably a couple ways to do it in, in X7, and I, I know this happened in X3. You can go down here and you had a, a menu to set your guidelines up. But in X7, it's gone and it's where they will all be in every one of them. You just go to guidelines, click on it, and go horizontal. And you always want to start at zero and press add. And we're going to go downhill, so we're going to negative four, negative eight, negative 12, negative 16. And then you can go over to vertical, hit zero, add. And then you can go four, add, eight, add, 12, add, and 16, add. And then you've got some guidelines set up. And if you'll notice, your last guideline that you're working on is always in red and your other colors are in blue. But that is the uh, one way, but it just, it seemed like it, it took a lot of time and, and uh, I think there's a better way. And I'll just show you the way I would do it. Not necessarily saying it's right. I'm going to go over and I'm going to set it near four. And then I'm, I'm going to click on it. And it's going to say 4.27, so I'm going to go 4. Now I'm going to change my nudge factor to 4 inches. And I'm going to go Control D to make a duplicate, and then move it over. Control D. Same thing here. Put that on 0. Control D. Control D. And in, the, in a lot quicker time, I was able to set up some guidelines then going up to tools, options, and changing this. Anyway, I hope that helped a little bit and thank you for watching.